a mage, huh? I don't like any of these. I guess I have to prepare for... It was quite a mountain to climb anyway. I'm not sure whether a healing card would have been enough to win me that game. Okay, let's wait. I hope this is a tempo mage and he plays an apprentice. Then I could SI7 agent it. If he plays a mad scientist, I can SI7 agent that one as well. I will al then we'll also check for mirror entity because the way death rattles trigger. So now when I SI7, if it's a mirror entity, he will get the SI7. Which is pretty much the worst minion in my deck, so... That's the best thing I can give him anyway. But it's not mirror entity. It can still be counter spell. This can still be tempo mage. But now this is looking very much like a freeze mage. I can't prep a sprint yet. Yeah, I can prep sprint next turn. But this is definitely a freeze mage. It's not a favored matchup for Oil Rogue. It's a pretty bad matchup. I have seven cards in hand. Using prep sprint will take me down to five, bring me up to nine, and then I will go up to ten next turn, so I can afford to do that. I won't burn a card. I just have to play something next turn, other than the Drake, because it's going to cycle. But yeah, this is fine. This is fine. I'll probably play the Belch next turn. Even if he plays a minion here, then he can't attack with that. Doomsayer. That's a little bit annoying. Especially so now that I have to play something. I guess he did it because I have to play something. Yeah, if I oil, but I will miss the oil effect from the minion. Yeah, you're, I guess you're right. It's not worst. I'll actually do that. I hope he doesn't have Taurus in here. If he has Taurus in here, I think this game is going to come to an end. Nope, no Taurus. In. But another Doomsayer. Ten cards in hand again. Oh, no real good way to kill it. I'll play one Belcher. That's still going to be a 1-2 after the Belcher dies. That's fine. I have the other Belcher in hand. I still get at least a minion. Now Doomsayers are gone. But all the freeze effects remain. He was able to delay me for two turns and I think that's pretty good for the freeze mage. He should be able to take this home now. He's getting to such mana levels that I don't think I will be able to challenge him. And he even had... He even had... Had Taurus and... I guess I will have to use... And eviscerate on Taurus and so I'll cycle a Drake just to eviscerate for five. Okay. <laughs> Optimistic here. Yeah. Um. Playing these kinds of deck against Freeze Mage doesn't tend to make you optimistic. Because it's almost impossible to win. Then you just sit here 20 minutes and... Maybe you can somehow win. But usually you can't. It's just the way the game works. So now that looks like a preparation for Blizzard. Blizzard ping. Okay, let him prepare for that. I'll develop some more board here. I don't want to play load about now because next turn he might Alex Traza. Let's just put up a bit bit more of a sticky board. There's the blizzard. Well, it's a freeze mage, of course he has Alex Traza. They all have Alex Traza. 
Nine cards. Nine cards, yeah. I just wonder if he's going to have flame strike. Flame strike would be pretty bad. On the other hand, he's probably going to be able to freeze this board many times because he has now used only one out of his four freeze effects. Let's play more raptors. Yeah, flame strike would be pretty bad here. Not that Blizzard would be much better. Oh wow. Can I kill Maligos? I guess I can kill Maligos, right? So I will poison and oil. And then this will be nine. It's poison and oil. That's 9, backstab is 3, 3 plus 9 is 12. So I'll backstab Maligos. Then I will hit face and flurry. And now Maligos is no more. Yeah, I could have sapped it. Maybe that would have been better. the blizzard. Blizzard and going face, huh? I guess I will draw with the fan. I don't want to load a bit yet. Let's play a shredder. Now both blizzards are gone. He might still have a flame strike. Cone of golds. Is he going to be able to set up lethal here? Just keep freezing the board and set up lethal. Maybe he can. How many cards do I have left? I still have cards left. I guess I'll prep that sprint. But I still can't kill him, right? So I can eviscerate for five. Four mana, I could eviscerate for six. And fan for three. And flurry, flurry for three. But he might get another block. Because I want to pop him now. He gets either another block or he gets a barrier. I hope that's a barrier. You know, it can go both ways. Oh dear, he had the block there. So now he has both. But he's still in a pretty rough spot. I should have this right. No, wait, he's going to get 8 health from that, so... I should have this. Need to pop him at one. He's at four. At one. There. And then I want to sap that guy. And load him. I should have this now. 
Surely he has no way to recover. He can't cast two spells. He would need to freeze my face and he would need to freeze the board. Got it. Thank you for watching. For more action, please visit my YouTube channel. And if you like what you see, remember to subscribe.